Good fences may make good neighbors, but this adage isn't very helpful when it comes to air pollution. In Michigan v. EPA, the court looks at the Clean Air Act's good neighbor provision and answers whether the EPA may consider costs when implementing certain pollution control measures in upwind states. The Environmental Protection Agency, or EPA, sets National Ambient Air Quality Standards, known as NACs, for six criteria pollutants. Once NACs are set, states then create state implementation plans, known as SIPs, which outline how the state will meet NACs. The EPA either approves the SIPs or requires a state to correct sections of the SIP through a process known as a SIP call. In 1998, the EPA issued the Nitrogen Oxide SIP call, a new rule under the Good Neighbor provision that was specifically designed to help downwind states that weren't able to achieve NACs for ozone. The Nitrogen Oxide SIP call required 22 states and Washington, D.C. to reduce interstate ozone pollution that contributed significantly to another state's non-attainment status. One feature of the nitrogen oxide SIP call required states to implement highly cost-effective control measures that could eliminate one ton of ozone for no more than $2,000. Michigan and other impacted states sued the EPA in the D.C. Court of Appeals.